Hello, Daniel. Um, we're talking to you now with the, well, in the old days, it would have been halfway through the season, but it's not eight races down. Um, if you had to sum up how the car has gone in eight races, what would you say? Where, where, where are our strengths? Where are our weaknesses? Uh, eight races down. I think, uh, you know, we would have liked to seen some more points on the board. I think that's, uh, that's probably one thing we're looking at, but that's, it's probably, um, not always the best indication. I think we've we've deserved points at times. Um, I think Valencia, we were wrong for points. Um, where else? Monaco, I think uh, John Arik, uh was looking pretty good for the points. Um, you know, there's been a few rounds where we could have gone gone a bit better, but, um, you know, I think we're, we're improving. You know, the other teams have, have found a step a bit earlier than us, but um, I think now we'll, we'll do the catching up. Okay, and what about yourself? How do- how do you think you've evolved in uh, in eight races uh, this season? I think I'm definitely evolving. Um, you know, the start of the season had a few uh, weaknesses um, with the starts and, and first laps weren't always that strong. But, uh, you know, the last couple, uh, um, the starts off the line have been good. Um, first lap, uh, at least in Valencia, was, was better. Uh, Monaco was also good. Um, so I think, you know, we're starting to put it together. I think my race pace as well has, has definitely developed and improved. Um, I think Montreal and, and Valencia, the two most recent rounds, um, I probably had my best race pace, um, of the season. So, uh, I think, you know, it's, it's all coming together. You know, we've got a, a long way to go, but, uh, we're on the right track. Definitely. Okay. Talking about a long way to go. If you had to, how do you think the rest of the season is going to go? There's some places where you think, uh, We've got a really good chance of doing well. Yeah, definitely. I think uh, there's many more opportunities to, to have some strong races. You know, and I, I want to start uh, this weekend coming in Silverstone. Um, it's a circuit I've always done well at and, and it's one I've enjoyed. So uh, also the weather can always mix it up. I've heard there could be some rain. So, um, you know, we'll see what happens. I think that's the first one where we can really start off strong. Um, Budapest I've always enjoyed. Um, Monza, obviously the home race for for Toro Rosso. So uh, these these places in in you know the, the next coming months will be, uh, I believe, strong for us. Okay, uh, you mentioned Valencia. Uh, I know you had time to relax a bit with um, some Sepsa guests and uh, members of staff there in the energy station, um, even playing table football and everything. Was, was that good fun? Bit of a change from the usual. Yeah, it was was good fun. Uh, you know, I got to got to hang out with uh, with some of the Sepsa guests and and you know speak with them and obviously they're very excited to to get our input on on how the season's been going and, and what we think of it and, and how we like Valencia, how we like their their country. Um, it was good fun. You know, then they had a few drinks and, and we played some table football and uh, I think it was Spain and Spain and France playing that evening. So uh, it was uh, quite a good atmosphere in, in the uh, in the energy station. Okay. Um, talking of the football, um, that this will probably get broadcast a bit after, but we're talking just a few hours before the final of the uh, European Cup. Um, can you come up with a polite answer for who you want to win? It's uh, Spain, Italy, and um, we're talking to Sepsa, and you drive for an Italian team. So, uh, <laughs> what's it? Have you got I'll, any predictions? I'll just, or... I'll just say, may, may the best team win. Okay. And uh, I hope that team is Italy. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. Um, but uh, just uh, have a word uh, with the, the SEPSA employees. Have you got a message for them going into uh, the British Grand Prix and the rest of the season? Yeah. Um, as always, we, we value your support. Um, it was great to see uh, a lot of you guys in, in Valencia. Um, we obviously hope to see you at, at more of the uh, upcoming races. Um, you're making uh, our life a bit easier, that's for sure. And uh, hopefully, you know, we're going to get some better results uh, in the next few races. And um, definitely, uh, I have faith and, and hope that this will happen. So let's, um, you know, let's make it a team effort and I'm sure we'll get better. Okay. Thank you very much, Daniel. Muchas gracias.